This is the authoring area of hot potatoes. I have prepared a multiple choice quiz. It is an activity on English pronunciation in which the student has to discern the correct stress of a phrase he or she is listening to. The phrase in the example is for all I know. The student is given three options and I indicate which one is correct. As question one, I want the sound file with a phrase. To achieve this, I need some lines of HTML code. In the code, I have to embed the sound file twice. I copy and paste the code into hot potatoes. Now I have the basic structure for the exercise and I save it. I have saved it already, so I replace the old one. By clicking on the save button, I save the exercise in its authoring environment, which is what we are looking at here. Please make sure you know where you are saving the file to so you find it again. The drop-down list shows you the path to your current folder. Also, don't use any spaces in the file name. You can open this file later to add more items. For students to do the exercises, you have to create a web page. A web page ends with .htm or .html. I save the web page next to the sound file or files I'm using in the exercise. Again, I've saved this file already, so I replace the old one. Click View the exercise in my browser to see the finished exercise. For all I know,